Please be there. Please be there. Please be there. What's up? You're still here. You're short. You're fat. And even for a film critic, you're ugly. <gasps> Good evening, everybody. Today we'll be playing Chulin. So try not to chew your lip. It is chocolate strawberries. Pour bottled water in your ass sockets. <laughs> Trad wife music. That was the worst Barry White impression on God's green earth. This game I'm going to play, you may or may not have heard of it. Um, it's one of those rare ps2 games in fact i love this is sort of a very very f like small focused interest i have rare ps2 games mind you i've i've got some relatively rare games off ebay for good price prices but all right here's a good example this is the first one 189 dollars okay this game it's supposed to be good is it 189 dollars good We'll see. <laughs> it's ridiculous. It's absurd. You know what? I'll do you one better. I have the. I've pirated these. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna come clean. I. I. I, <laughs> I actually spent a day downloading all these like impossible to find games. <laughs> Condition. Yeah. Bitten by a dog. Yeah. <laughs> this one. This is. This is. This is. This is PS2 game collector's end game. Are you ready for this? Now that, this is a diamond. Do you have this? Oh look, same publisher as Samurai Western. Funny that. Get them neck to <laughs> Why are you paying attention to the neck? That's not the main event. This is. Neck to points, yeah. Oh yeah, I bought Rule of Roads for 400 quid. <laughs> so I could get half off on Naval Oranges from Sainsbury's. <laughs> That's the real reason. Two bids, six days. Okay, six days, two bids. That's gonna double. That's gonna. I'm sorry, no, w without a question, that price will double. I've, I've been around on eBay long enough. When this game was ported to the West, say ported, released in the West, um, the manual, because games used to come with a small manual, the manual in the US version actually has the walkthrough of the game. So, like you would buy a walkthrough like Brady Games or whoever the top people were back then, or go on like Game FAQs. This just came with the game in the manual. <laughs> and see, your guide to long like it's just an outright walkthrough. Which is rip <laughs> She's <laughs> Oh my god, it's like the She's fourteen. Zam <laughs> Why do we have to know her age, but his weight? Look, London Underground, Studio Pot, are you kidding me? <laughs> the London Borough of Tulip, are you kidding me? New game. <laughs> it is me, the Tumblr Tree. I have a funny Tumblr nose. A boy and a girl from two different parts of the world. They met and fell in love. The kiss of happiness. What I want is your name. Your name, boy. Not your moniker. Not your handle. Not your alias. Your name. What do your parents call you, boy? Uh, what? Emojis, Sony boys, rise up. <laughs> huh? KMF input, yeah. <laughs> Hang on, let me let me put in a. No, we Oh, stand you stand brackets. Oh, wicked. Kono standu power, bravo shaku. I see. 
Oh, is this the trad wife? No, I'm a trad wife in the wheat fields. What is her name? Oh no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Should I just call her trad? <laughs> trad wife. <laughs> PS5? Is that what we're going to name her? This has to last the whole game. It can't be just like a cop-out one-off joke because it will get annoying really fast. I'm going to call her... <laughs> I was gonna call her Sony. She was named after her dad's favorite thing. Wait, where are the numbers? No numbers! Ah, lame. Come on, don't overthink the joke. Just do it. This is an old reference. Aya, 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 aya. Name her next. <laughs> Next. Her name is Joby. Her name is Aya Aya. <laughs> Wait, we're fucking out like getting married? Ex what? <laughs> Am I a postman? Now you may kiss the bride. What? Look at his lips. This is 3 2 Long Life Town. The sun is setting. Nobody knows where they are from. Secretly, quietly, and modestly. Joby and his father moved in. No matter how poor we are, we'll always be together. That's something my dad would say. That little pearl, that little nugget of wisdom. My sister and I, when we, we do impressions of our dad, and my dad does this thing when, like, if he thinks if he thinks something is absurd, his voice will go high pitch. So, if <laughs> if um, if we say something like, uh, you know, like, oh, do you think this absurd thing is true? You know, my dad would be like, no, no, like that. <laughs> it's just something my dad does, and my sister and I we joke about it. You sound like a British and a New Yorker. The two worst things in the world. <laughs> Let's go Mets, baby. Sodding Mets. I've got Pee Wee Herman hands. <laughs> Good for you and your father. I guess you're wondering where I've been. I heard the new tenants moved in. I heard they're from a big city in the west. A poor Joby, he he he. All right, don't rub it in, fucking turnip head. Oh, I can read Japanese. That sign says, um, it says no brapping. Oh my god. It's the missing member of the Beatles. Oh, I've never seen you before. Kids don't have to work. Grown ups do. <laughs> Oh, those are his teeth. I thought that was his tie. Okay, yeah, he's definitely from the UK then. Me and Ringo were playing tulip and, you know, we were just, you know, messing about and, you know, that's what we did back then. We were just a band, man. He looks like a USSR postman. Yeah, he's a post, postmodern, post, postman. Oh, she's ugly. I mean, nice to meet you. You look like a nice kid. I'm Michelle. My house is in the first district near Turtle Bath. Why didn't you come to my place tomorrow? <laughs> nice to meet you, kid. <laughs> Gave me the fucking Steve Buscemi eyes. How do you do, Joby? How do you do, Joby? This is Markiplier, and I'm LARPing as a doctor today. Come to my Let's Players Hospital anytime. Oh. Good morning, sugar dumpling. Nice to meet you. I'm Aya Aya. I live in Long Life Town. <laughs> Markiplier. Put Markiplier in the corner. Hang on. I want to get uh, a <laughs> port. $10,000 bit. Here we go. I gotta get back to talking to my boo, my squeeze. 
what did, what did kids call it now? When I was young, it was boo, you know? Hey, boo, that shit, you know? And that, and that's, it was, before that, it was my main squeeze. Now, what's, what is it now? What's the word now? What do the kids say? Hey, do you want to give me a kiss? Just kidding. Oh, you'd kiss someone you've just met? By the way, what's your name? It's a secret. Lads, what are we going to do? Are we just going to be up front? Or are we going to play it coy? Hold our cards to our chest. What are we going to do? Calling it, this is a dream. Uh, I think the word you're looking for is nightmare. Weird name. Oh, okay, fucking Aya Aya. The only guy screaming your name is fucking Tom Kenny, mate. When he's, <laughs> when he's voicing Spongebob. So you can shut that weird name shit down. <laughs> you the poor boy who just moved in? Yes. I knew it. So you are really poor. This town's full of assholes. By the way, you've never kissed, have you? This game's jokerified, mate. I'm sorry. Yeah. Alright. I'm not... I knew it. There is no way. Well, better believe it. <laughs> this is a hot. This is hot. You. Oh, I. What? You'd pay a hundred and eighty dollars for this? This is torture porn. You're poor, but you're pretty smart, Joby. But you are not my type. Was that the bite of 87? You and I kissed in your dream? That's just a dream. This is reality. I think in this game, you gotta, you gotta climb the echelons of love. Oh, four or five. Oh, so that's health. Of course it is. So what, I get five slaps and then what? You call the authorities? Is that how this game works? So she's, she's the final... She's, she, is she like the final boss? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, you stupid crow. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, serious question. Is she the final boss? Yes! Why does she look like Kermit the Frog's half-Japanese <laughs> bastard child? Well, you, you, should I say that to her? Should I act all horrible to her? And Should I give her the sweet potato? Oh, no, nah, she's not going to want that. After that grilling she gave me, sweet potato is not going to cut the mustard. Oh, my God. Oh, lips. Oh, is this why this song's... Song? Is this why this game's called Tulip? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck you think you're doing? You're heartbroken, however. As a person, Joby, your father loves you from the bottom of his heart. Oh. So the love of my father has restored my faith in humanity. You met the girl you saw in your dream? When you tried to give her a kiss? Your heart was broken? Is that right? That's okay. Don't worry about it. I have a plan to win her over. Operation Love Letter. Write a love letter using this. If only you had it, you could write a love letter. I definitely put it in this box. I really did. Tulip looks at Reddit once. <laughs> Zero out of five. R slash big loafers. <laughs> that could be wordplay. Big loafers is in shoes and like also big loafers because they're just like big guys who loaf around all day, you know? This was such an interesting period for games where there was no one way of doing things. You could just sort of do, make a game about anything. You know? There were no trends. There were no, like... Oh, trash! 
Yes! There were no trends. It was just trash! Exactly, yeah. It, yeah. Quality trash. That's the dog! He, he really is in the doghouse now, isn't he? Figuratively and literally. Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> what a romp. Hey, maybe if I give God, I'm going to give the dog a sweet potato. Nope. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm so fucking good at this game. Oh, you found a letter set, and you took it from a vicious dog? You're pretty good. I'm so happy I could cry now. Write a love letter with that letter set right away. My dearest angel, dear Aya Aya, love you. I really, really love you. I love you very much. <laughs> Like a kiss from a rose. <laughs> so what, I just give this to her and she turns into butter? Go brag about it to our neighbours. <laughs> what am I going to say? My son's a freak. Try releasing this game today. You couldn't. Not because it's always inappropriate or some rubbish like that. Because just people wouldn't... The, 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 it would, it'd be too, it'd be weird, but it's not weird in the right way, you know? I implore you to reconsider, ma'am. Oh, a letter. For whom? You have to take it to the mailbox. But you're right there? <laughs> okay, you're right fucking there. Wait a week, okay, see if I give a shit. What the fuck? <laughs> you have to take care of your employees. Pay your workers. No one can live without money. <laughs> yeah, if David did a Lord of the Rings stage play, he'd be treebeard. What is this Mona the Vampire fucking CITV jingle? What the fuck? <laughs> this is <laughs> Silent Hill. What the hell? Bad. <laughs> she can live He's got ogre voice. What? <laughs> Our only daughter, Aya Aya, ran away. <laughs> Why don't you do something? <laughs> <laughs> That's her dad. That's her old man. Wow, no wonder she hates men. <laughs> I'm free. I'm an artist. I don't do anything. You don't have to do anything. I don't want to walk around. I, I likes cats. She'll come home whenever she wants. It's a, what has that got to do with the price of fish? She likes cats. What? Julie, what are you doing? <laughs> He's like um, Jeff Garland. He's like a very heavily exaggerated Jeff Garland. I'm Goro. That's my wife. That's my bitch succubus wife. I'm Mrs. Plum of this. I should do a voice. I'm Mrs. Plum of the snack shop. Oh, Toby, the poor boy. Have some sweets. Nurse your pearl heart. School hours are 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. here. <laughs> what, what, what's the time? 10 a.m. To... What the jumping fuck <laughs> does that say? The fart woman? The fart woman? Cuphead? I'm, I'm absolutely baffled. That's like a real texture in it. Well, this game's a bit weird, but is it weird enough to warrant the fart? What? That is extraordinary. 
<laughs> it's got like a, it, it looks really serious as well. It looks like a John Woo movie. Like Die Again, uh, what was it? Um, Another Tomorrow or something like that. It looks, it looks really serious. It's like Chow Yun Fat in the middle there. Boom. Hey. Hey, you. Your love letter is terrible. <laughs> You're the new guy in town. Your name is Joby? I already know her. I'm the train conductor. I've been working here for 20 years. I bet you put the rock on the train tracks. Terrible. That's just terrible. Can't trouble people just because you are poor. Stupid kid. Okay, you're an asshole. Nice to meet you. I'm the officer here. I keep Long Life Town nice and safe. Count on me with the night patrol. I see. You moved into the old, that old house? That means you were poor. You can't commit a crime just because you were poor. This is a horror movie. This this is a horror movie. This is a torture porn horror like social piece. This is awful. Smooch there's a chapter in this manual called Smooching for Success. You know what? This game, you just walk up to strangers and snog them. It, it, it's still less pernicious than than the dating app scene. Even less so. Like there's there's no contact with those apps well, until you you know up, until you actually go all the way. But like uh, there's there's something there's like a psychopathy about it, you know. Whereas at least this game, like at least it's jovial, at least it's like jolly, you know. And also, it's a video game. <laughs> yeah, you can send uh, you can send a love letter <laughs> a love letter to the company. Dear Netsume Studios, I really, really love you. Oh, he's here! Uh, I'm gonna get romance advice from a guy in the sewers. Nice Wes Anderson camera angle. That's him. This is the man who will save my life. This is a local apartment unit, 103. I call it Neat. Paradise. That is not important right now. Your love letter is the pro. I gotta get more spit for this character. Okay, ready. <clears throat> Your love letter is the problem. It was not good at all. Why not? Why not? You don't know. It doesn't have your heart in it, boy. You can't write a good love letter like that. Good love letter? If you can write a good love letter, you can kiss her under the legendary tree on the hill. It's turning into Jorah the Andal now. Khaleesi, you must cross the narrow sea and kiss under the legendary tree hill. That is where the first men were born, Khaleesi. Even if you try to write a letter with your heart, your heart is immature and weak. You are at level one, poor boy. Before you profess your love to her, you need experience. This is like a fucking Jordan Peterson clean your room, go out there and make love fucking speech. <laughs> Let's begin your lessons. <laughs> Come here, you lonely lady. Whoa! Onion lady is... No, I called the other bitch onion lady. There's an actual onion lady in the game? If you get close now, you'll get hurt. It's called what? Give her a kiss. Let's start practicing. Kiss onion lady. Jesus Christ. It's not my finest hour, is it? <laughs> I'm fucking unlovable. I am unfucking lovable. <laughs> yeah, this is like 
L bags. This is your hypotheticals. Oh, Joe, if you were uh, on a beach in Miami and you had to wear a Reddit shirt and wear a Sherlock Holmes hat, what would you say to the fairer sex? I'd, I'd stand there like an idiot. I wouldn't know what to do. It's not hypothetical. That's just a bad day for me. Oh, God. Heaven must be missing an angel, missing one angel child. <laughs> Mission complete and how? Domo. Domo arigato. Bravo, bravo. Joby, you did it. Now your heart will grow a little bit. Now go home and tell your father. Well then, goodbye, take care. Right, geez, geez. You wouldn't fucking believe the bird I had down in the man now. Fuck it out, fuck it out. The fucking onion bird! On Love Street Avenue! Get out! The, the dad, like, um... <laughs> He rips up the love letter. He says, I just saved your Vera, mate. That onion bird is a manta. <laughs> I'm just going to go to bed in my, my male boy uniform. Everyone is talking about Joby. I'm so worried about my son's <laughs> reputation that I can't sleep. <laughs> um... That's a bit too uh, close to home there. Parents can stay awake at night with fucking bloodshot eyes. You know, our son is a neat. <laughs> What's the fucking point of the movement of it all? Davey has kissed one times in his whole life. Fantastic. I shall strengthen his heart. His reputation will be better. Davey has reached level two. <laughs> He will now commute on a train for three hours. It was an hour and 58 minutes, and it's all part of the grind, okay? Well, actually, there and back. So it was over three hours, yeah, sure. Point still remains. According to the paper, <laughs> local incel runs amok. Just the, the Sun newspaper. In cell? In a cell? <laughs> it's just me, like, in a prison. <laughs> it's fucking tulip in a prison cell. This is the best fucking video game ever made, bar fucking none. Oh. Morning, sugar dumpling. What is your happiness? Eye is eye is happy places. Top three. Spot no... It, fuck off, Watch Mojo. Like, I give a shit. Oh. Uh, no, sh she's watching. I don't want to dig the dirt. She's looking at me. What was I saying? Well, as soon as I resume my, my train of thought, I'm going to be introduced to some new weird shit, so I better put it on hold. A lot of young men, rejection is like a poison. It, 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 it's hell. But you have, you, you, you have to get used to it, otherwise you just stagnate, you know? This is what a problem a lot of young men have. They can't face the music. And it's in its and it's a very true thing. Oh shit! When you get three crime stamps, you'll be sent to the graveyard. <laughs> Not even prison, just the graveyard. Code of conduct. Keep okay, this is for this Twitch chat as well. This applies here. Keep Clothes on, do not smoke, do not steal. Okay, the second one, I don't really care, but one and three are, you know, quite crucial. You failed four. <laughs> the secret rule, have fun. Yeah, you failed that. <laughs> Whoa! Fuck off! You just shot me! You just shot me. 
I mean, that's what happens, you know. Men, we, you know, we get obsessed. You know, we, we, you know, our proclivity. We, 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 we equate success and happiness in life with the proclivity to attract women that we've never met, and then we just end up getting ourselves shot. It's, it's a tra It's a sad. It's a sorry state of affairs. It really is. It really is. Continue from the bathroom in his house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, continue from that exact moment. That'd be great. All right, I'll teach you. Three rules to make Aya Aya fall in love with you. Very important. Um, gym, money, and y y you... Uh, <laughs> you have to be mean to her. Rule of love one. Rouge of love. <laughs> the bigger your heart, the more popular you are. If tens people like you, she will she'll know you're a good guy. The rules of love are the rules of the universe. The rules of the universe are the rules of long life town. Rule number two. I can't bring people back from the dead. Love are the rules of the universe. The rules of the universe are the rules of long life. It's poetic, isn't it? I think it's supposed to be because it's got like little musical notes. Keep yourself updated on what's happening. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, you want to have a successful relationship. Your net, your network is your net worth, baby. Brian set. Fuck that. <laughs> He says as he scoffs on a cold sweet potato he got from the trash. Rule number four, drop her Twitch account. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got my card. This is some Mr. Miyagi shit. He's like, you're not ready. And your son, you are not ready. Come on, Mr. Miyagi, come on. Mr. Miyagi, I'm the karate kid. And your son, you are the karate kid. That is the name of the movie. Daniel son. Mr. Miyagi! Yeah. <laughs> Ip Man 5. <laughs> Dad, <laughs> I've got a swollen face. Dad, I had a rough day. Dad, I need money! <laughs> Come on with a fucking swollen face. <laughs> you know, just eating a potato out the bin. Dad, I need money. I'm I'm the most useless piece of shit who ever lived. We are poor. We have very little money. <laughs> when you come home broken-hearted, I'll cheer you up. Yeah, going to bed at four o'clock. You know, I don't blame this guy. When you're depressed, people who suffer from depression just fucking go to bed at like six. You know, like let's just get this fucking day over with. No, it is it is it is. You'll be shocked. It's either that or insomnia. You know, it's it's just so polarizing. Uh, <laughs> yeah, a serious conversation about depression, followed by clown noise. Funny Bone Factory. Yeah, that's this stream. We're, we're the Funny Bone Factory. It's seeking a worker. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, oh, one, two, three, four. It's just one, two, three. I'm an idiot. I was trying to memorize. <laughs> I'm a shit for brains. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, one, two, three, four. Quick. Okay. What was that number again? Oh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, got it. Fuck. <laughs> the dog killed me. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, I'm level two hard worker. I have no game. I have no car, no girlfriend, no job, no dick. I get it. I'm a loser, okay? Can we just get on with the story? Oh, she likes astronomy. Uh, I can't compete with that. Trying to impress her. Like, uh... uh my favourite star is... Uh, uh, Ursa Major. So you mean I'll Ursa Major? Oh, hi, Super. How are you doing, Super? We're having a real... Barrel of laughs here. Quick, tell her Mercury is in retrograde. 
this is 3D Earthbound. Yeah. Where, yeah, where's the Cromer? Pay your workers. <laughs> Mr. Yamara. We just can't do it. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Suzuki, aka Jeff Bezos. We just can't do it. Deposit my salary into my account by the end of the month. Otherwise, I'll quit. No, don't do that. You're so sexy. Ha <laughs> ha. Danger. Play with caution. Is especially that it is four times more dangerous than the swings. Many people get injured. There's something like this in Final Fantasy. Slido! <laughs> That, that, that really, everything kills you in this game. This game's lethal. Everyone is talking about Joby. I'm so worried about my son's reputation that I can't sleep. What? No one. <laughs> you don't have to kiss someone every day, Dad. I'm so disappointed I'm going to cry. The humor of this game is is perfect now. Just just the um the deprecation just is just ceaseless. It 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 could have really this this really could have come out yesterday. Chibi Shenmue. Hurt me. Oh that's that's convenient. Okay. Poopy. That's fucking disgusting. This park is is horrible. This is the worst park in the world. I just picked up shit from the trash can and took that. No, it doesn't heal me. Fuck you. <laughs> I should have got the poopy first. AJ from Sopranos plays Tulip. Yeah, and he rips the space station off the shelf. <laughs> when are you going to throw that freaking thing at the freaking window? Oh, shit. Okay. Well, okay. That makes sense. You can't just walk into people's house. It says. What's the matter with you? You can't enter someone's yard like that, okay? Oh my god, you just can't. Oh my god. You're one of those, you know, peeping toms. Carmella. <laughs> Does that voice still exist? Or was it like, breeded out of existence? Oh my god. What is slang that's popular that you despise? Um, all of it. There are a couple ones that I still hate, but they're, but they're at least they're funny. Okay, oh, don't. This game gives me anxiety. Like, I just, what's in here? Hey, this is pretty cool. Too bad there's nothing in here. Oh, shit. Shit. Is it like past my curfew? Like this, this is an awful town. No! Oh! Yeah, I'm going to bed. Oh yeah, and to save you the trouble, Dad, didn't kiss anyone today. I'm sorry. Well, we can't all be skirt chasing Casanovas like you were when you were young, could we? So, how's the alimony going? I kissed no one, but I bought 300 Ethereum. All right, on the subject of slang, here's one. Yut. That's a funny one, because it's like, it's like yuck. It's not intuitive, right? It's like, yuck, you know, yuck. Hang a ling a yuck ting man. Man ding ting, ping a ying ting wing ting. Look at the batty on that ting, bro. Don't fuck up the bass. Yeah, that, that type of speak is, is is very frustrating to hear. Try translating that. 
Yeah, put, put, run that through Rosetta Stone. See what happens. Oh. The school doesn't pay me my salary. He's going to get Chris b b shoulders the size of Boulder's Redfield to move that hunk of junk out the way. I'm going to sell this to pay for my peaceful retirement. Thief! most like <laughs> boing 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 that's like the most like um like adhd noise ever <laughs> according to the paper the rock incident is over and the trains are running the love letter set was stolen from the house of the michi suzuki okay the culprit is then yamada this is like a reddit that they keep saying their age you know they do that me m35 and my wife, F25, uh, fell off the roof today and she won't talk to me. She's the only decent looking like person in, in this whole shit village. Everyone else is, is a freak. It's like, you know, a mob psycho when he, he likes that girl, but every other girl in comparison just looks like a potato or a spud or some rubbish. <laughs> Okay, so it's 10.30. Oh, i got to wait till 1. Oh, fuck that for a laugh. Just like real train schedules. The train I used to get to work um, every day was, was absolutely abhorrent. It was, it was... Like, we're supposed to be a country known for our, like, you know, our relatively good public transport, right? Absolute fallacy. This particular line, like a bit of rain and there was an hour delay. It's the 21st century. What, why aren't there ways to circumvent it? Well, dad, I didn't kiss any girls, but today I was surrounded by cocks. Go to Forbidden Planet. <laughs> We're supposed to be getting a good reputation, right? Oh my god, I went to Forbidden Planet with my... <laughs> yeah, I'm the perfect type audience for this game. Um, with my f uh, friends of mine when I was in Wales. My god. My okay, I'm, I've got to pause. I've got to pause the MA for this story because there's no... Right? There was someone in there, right, by the... By the oh my god, by the... Uh, by the manga. And it was someone's wife or auntie or girlfriend or sister. I don't know. And she, she weren't from Wales. She was from London and she was like, right, yeah, right, yeah. So, what are you looking for? Jojo's, which one? We've got Jojo's, we've got Phantom Blood or Battle Tendencies. Yeah, I just feel like going up to her. She's like, madam, pass me the phone. And I was like, listen here, buddy, you're a fucking part skipper, okay? You can't, you know, you can't. <laughs> You know, Jonathan Joestar is a gentleman, okay? Don't be, don't be skipping him out. He, she said Jojo's, you know, battle tendencies, you know, like the multiple, <laughs> not just the one battle tendency. I, I don't have a ticket. Shit! No, no! The train left! No! Oh god! No! Oh, that's okay. We just have to wait until 5.30. That's good. Just gotta wait four hours for the next train. La la la. Oh my god! Let's make everywhere sparkling! Okay, I had to... There was a massive storm. I had to get a different train. So I was at this train station. Like one I'd never been to before, and a guy, I saw a guy, and I really felt sorry for him, because I've, I've been there, right, he missed his train by seconds, right, and then when the train parted, he just, he just, like, threw his, it was like something from a, like a, like an Edgar Wright thing, and he just went, fuck, like that, <laughs> and I didn't, I, I wasn't even, 
mad. I was like, mate, I, I, I totally get it. A train to Worldly Bizarre Temple leaves it. <laughs> I almost gave him the poopy. <laughs> <laughs> is this supposed to be me? Oh, it's from Liar Liar. All right, okay. No, not Liar. What's it called? Li liar Liar is the Jim Carrey thing. It's Big Fat Liar. Yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. It's showtime, Mr. Funny Bones. Look out! Not enough money. Some six foot four Navy SEAL is gonna, you know, come to the stream and be like, "What the fuck is he saying?" Nerd, and leave. You owe me ten thousand, a hundred thousand. Oh, he's getting beat up. He's a, he's a, he's a hypocrite. <laughs> no wonder, no wonder he was such a hard ass to, um, Mr. Suzuki. He, he was in debt. He was in deep shit. You know what this music is? Katamari. It's 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 the Katamari genre. Japanese people see this as tame, but they watch something like EastEnders and, and they're like, this is fuck. They probably think it's extremely boring. If a Japanese person watched EastEnders, you know, and they knew what was going on, you know, they'd be like, this is fucking boring. Where's, where's the schoolgirl going, eh? You know, there's none of that in there. They'd be like, EastEnders is mid. <laughs> All grown up, some money grabbers. <laughs> I took the love letter set from Mr. Suzuki. I'm one of them. I hate myself. I hate my life. I want to be happy, but what really makes me happy? This is sad. Mr. Funny Bones and Paul Giamatti fused. Okay, let's see this. <laughs> Mr. Funny Bones, it was showtime 15 years ago. Who's this old dude? Worldly Desire Temple. Agony Man. <laughs> great, yeah, great superpower. Feeling agony. Hobby, toilet cleaning. Age 20, 27. Um, okay. That, it really is agony when you look like that at 27 and you're contorted like that like there's something else <laughs> good for you and your streamer <laughs> <laughs> oh is it, it can he hurt there's no way he, he can't hurt me he has to hurt me that's just a fact like a dog barking at me floors me you know, God, only God knows what the bringer of death does. Brandon, I'm Louis Armstrong. I see red roses, red roses too. The Grim Reaper will follow you closely. Red roses too, and I think to myself, red roses too. You can't just go around kissing grapes. That's not how it works. The Oda family. That's, that's the One Piece guy. <laughs> Dreaming, don't give it up, tulip. Is this the graveyard where your stand will awaken? Yeah. <laughs> stand user. Tulip. Kono stand power. Kiss from a rose. And then the stand stats come up on the screen, you know, during the, the I, call, I call them loading screens. What are they? They're like splash cards, not loading. It's like, you know, fucking loading screens for the anime. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. During the ad breaks. Meanwhile, guys just popped out of a grave. You want the loving? Oh, you want the love ink now, do you, Mr. Miyamata? No way. No way, Jose. I'm going to sell to make some dang good money. But wait. <laughs> but wait, if you do me a favor, I'll give it to you. Mr. 
Love is in the air. <laughs> Fuck this game. I just kissed a Scooby Doo monster. I one step closer to being pussy magnet. And he fucking died. Oh no. He gave me shit on a cat. I'm a whore. <laughs> I'm a I'm a whore. <laughs> oh my god, it's Dio. Purple Dio. Dio drank the Vimto, and that's what he looks like. <laughs> Vimto, more like Vim's lair, where where Tulip came from, no doubt. No, I I have paid two hundred quid for this game. Don't don't worry, <laughs> don't worry. Why am I laughing? <laughs> Hasty wizard's life. Age twenty thousand. Hobby jogging. You know what? He's on that paleo diet. No wonder he's lived so long. Bloody <laughs> man, son. This is gonna take a snog! Ooh. Oh, okay. Uh, shit. I like how the game is involved. You have to physically take something out and show them. You can't just press X on everything. You have to sort of use your brain a little bit more. I'm a pompous boy. <laughs> I've, that's somehow worse? Don't kiss a wizard, you'll become pompous. When do I reach rank fuck boy? That's like level 99, mate. <laughs> Tulip wearing like the supreme. <laughs> I got a Glock in my Rari. <laughs> and I got the soda. <laughs> Give the poo to Aya. You know what? It just might work. It's like a secret ending. She's like, oh, you're so funny. I love a bit of shit. You know, secret, secret shit, poopy, poop shit ending. <laughs> yeah, that that's a strategy in this game. Just pretend to be Ryan Gosling. They'll never know. There's something inside you. <laughs> it's, it's hard to explain. They're talking about you, boy. And you're still the same. I'm gonna drive you through the night and give you the poo gift. My friend Agony Man has cleaned the dirty restroom for me. Um, your network, it really is your net worth. The moon's got a face on it, who saw that? Was that like something from, um, Soul Eater? Oh! Oh my god, it's a freaking eggplant. Holy crap, Lewis. Oh my god, Lewis, it's Mr. Eggplant! Well, I know he comes out at 7 o'clock at night for what that's worth. When that information is going to be useful, that's up for debate. Oh my god, it's the, it's the keratin. Mr. Frog. Fuck, that's from fucking Smiley. But hello, I'm Mr. Frog. I eat the bug. Yeah, do, do I need to reference that? <laughs> you know what I'm on about. Eggplant Boy's Life. Very imaginative names. These are like, wow. Hobby, movies. The saying of the day is, an eggplant is an eggplant. <laughs> yeah, the average r slash movie buff user looks like that. I just turn into a giant eggplant. Fuck right off. I got killed by shit. Fuck off. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. What am I... What is a boy to do?
Oh, wait, 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 wait. Best sweet potato, that's good. We're rich, fellas. We're in the money now. Well, that's expensive looking. Uh, how about you go cunch your head in, mate? I had a teapot and a best baked potato. Gone forever. I'm actually, I'm actually so annoyed. <laughs> I'm so unbelievably annoyed. What if you just went... <coughs> what if you just ate it? <laughs> That'd be horrifying and disgusting too.